Hey guys, this is uh, making a how-to video. It's making charcoal for Pyrotech 81. Um, charcoal is a uh, black, uh, like uh, black solid, um, and you use it uh, many, many, um, many different purposes. It has has um, hardwood charcoal has uh, purposes for effects in shells and mines and things. Or um, curry mores and softwood uh, such as um, bolsa, uh, paper bark, um, things like that are used for manufacture of BP. Okay, um, best thing for softwood is uh, BP. Uh, as softwood is the best thing for BP as the um, softwood will burn, make the um, make the BP burn quite very very quickly. Um, so here's the method. Basically, you get a big tin, a big silver tin, or it doesn't have to be silver, just a big tin, like with Milo, something like Milo, Milo old coffee or something in it, and get all the contents out of it. Make sure you wash it out. Um, so you're going to do that, and you're going to get the lid, and you're going to drill a couple of holes in it. You can drill uh, several smaller holes. I've dr I, I actually like to drill three bigger holes because then I know uh, how equal the, um, the the smoke's coming out. As you can see now, how equally it's cooking. And you're gonna chuck it onto a burner, um, preferably a um, just like a normal hot plate burner, not hot plate, um, normal gas burner. And um, you're gonna put all your paper bark or any wood. You can use hardwood as well, except hardwood will take quite a while. Paper bark will only take probably. No, you're sure it's my first time paper bark. Last time I used wood, um, it was like 45 minutes, like an hour and 15. Um, hopefully these paper bucks hopefully going to take about half an hour to an hour so hopefully that and I'm starting off on low right and then as it uh, cooks you're gonna um, increase the temperature you can get massive flame out getting quite bigger and more rapid smoke come out so I'm just gonna start off low just to start charring the um, paper bark and then as it stops slows down a bit I'm gonna heat it up just minor by minor don't go high because high will actually over over burn it, it'll actually burn it. Just go med to medium, so just as it stops burning a bit, just go medium. Um, method for checking whether it's done. Um, you can put 30 degree burns on your hand and actually open the top. It's not quite a good idea though. Um, and you will let all of the um, gas um, that's in there, you'll let all oxygen go in there and it could actually burn. So you will leave it on. Um, two, there's, there's two uh, usual methods that I use. I, I use them both. Um, first one is the steam. You can see smoke. I, I don't know why I said steam. Smoke. Uh, you can see, I'm trying to get a good background. We can see all that smoke. That's, I think that's the best one there. You see all the smoke coming out of that. And it reeks. It, it stinks out. It smells like a fire. Um, all the smoke coming out. Well, that's a signal that the all the um, saps and all the chemicals and substance substances in the paper bark or the wood are actually um, burning and evaporating or va vaporizing so they're going off and um, so that's basically what's happening and that's if the smoke starts to slow down turned up to about medium and then if the smoke actually stops um, then you're done and there's also another way where you can get like a skewer like I've got here um, just get it a light okay you want a little bit of light and chuck it on right see that actually it's actually flaming So you don't want to do it too long because you actually burn it. Um, so that's just checking method. Um, but oh shit! But that's actually how you can also check. Just let me wash this. That's also another method. Method how you can check on it. Um, you'll see like a whole heap of um, fire or flames bounce around the top of it. Um, let me get that charcoal. Get rid of that um, stick. Um, you'll see a whole heap of flames jump around, uh, jump around on the top, and that's all. That's all the um, all the vaporized uh, chemicals from the sap, from the um, wood or bark that are actually vaporizing. So that's what's actually burning because they're actually flammable, uh, like eucalyptus. Especially if you're burning eucalyptus wood, um, very very careful with that because some of the saps and things that will come out of that will actually um, like burn it will expand actually couldn't uh, like a sort of like a hydrogen a uh, hydrogen 
uh, ID, like, yeah, sort of like exploding hydrogen, so not as, not as intense. So that's the method to make charcoal, guys. After this, I'm going to make a vi short video on my new ball mill and grinding up some of this charcoal. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, be very careful making this as it is on hot plate. Oh, we're pyros, aren't we? Anyway, guys, thanks. This is Pyrotech81, and thanks for watching.